Hi folks, this is Vince with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to try out Card Quest. It's important to note that the game is still under development, so everything that you're about to see here is subject to change. You can find it on Steam's Early Access program for about 7 or 8 bucks should you want to pick it up for yourself. This is my first time playing, I just got my press key, so this is going to be a first impressions video. So, here's the main menu, Tutorial, and I guess these are different levels that you can play, Curse City. A city infected with a terrible plague, will you be able to escape? Hmm. Dwarven Mountains, a mysterious mountain with a maze of caves and tunnels. Will you find its treasure? Enchanted Forest. This level is not available in this version of the game. Okay, like I said, early access. Equipment. Rogue, Wizard, and Fighter. So it looks like there's three classes right now in the game. Options menu, bottom left-hand corner. Music, ambient sound, sound effects, and delete save file. I have the music off for the sake of the commentary and to prevent copyright issues. Okay, so let's go ahead and do the Cursed City. Although I may want to start with the tutorial, so I know what I'm doing. Welcome to Card Quest. It's your turn. Pick an attack card to deal some damage. Dull Slash. Attack melee. Deal three damage. Chain. Uh, cost minus one. Okay, so I see in the upper right hand corner there's stamina. There's health. So I'm guessing there's this three little lightning symbol is stamina. And that's how much stamina I need in order to play the card, I'm guessing. Deal extra damage. Plus two and draw a card. I think maybe that's with the chain. Alright, so I select someone now. Oh, there we go. Good, you started a chain. Most cards have extra effects when played during a chain. Now attack again. Should I attack the same person or a different one? Excellent, all cards have a stamina cost. Be careful not to spend too much in one turn because you'll need some to defend yourself. Now you're out of attack cards. It's a good time to defend. Enemies will attack you one by one during their turn. Pick a defensive card to block or dodge each of their attacks. Well, I got a lot of arm parries. I might as well block time, uh, block two and draw one card. As a chain, block one extra and draw one card. All right. How much? Okay, they do two damage each. It's your turn again. With each new turn, you regain five stamina, and you draw a new card. Cheap Trick will stun its target, making it unable to attack during its turn. I should probably do that to two of them. One. Cheap Trick also has a special effect. You can activate check active effects here. That's it for the basics. Use the chain and effects to your advantage, and remember to save stamina for defense. Have fun. All right. Next attack deals plus two damage. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and do the Dull Slash against this one. There we go. And a Dull Slash should knock... Well, he's stunned, so he won't move. Let's do this. Let's Cheap Trick this one. Stun him. And then we'll attack this one. Oh. Dull Slash. There we go. And Dull Slash. Congratulations, you've now completed the tutorial. Go and pick a class and try out one of the dungeons. Okay, let's do Curse City. And we'll be the wizard. Arcane Skull. Primary Book of Lightning and Secondary Scrolls. Armor empty, trinket empty, bag empty. Uh, nothing equipped. Defeat bosses to unlock items. Okay, so it looks like I'll be getting more cards as I play from the looks of it. And these are my default ones. Unaware is a question mark. Unaware enemies will pass their turn unless they are attacked. Distant enemies will pass their turn unless they have a ranged attack. I already know what stun is. Alright. Hey stranger, wake up. The innkeeper's face is shockingly pale as he bursts into your room. Grab your gear and hurry. They're almost in. As you step outside through the back door, a foul stench takes you by surprise. Revenants. They're lurking all over the old town. We need to make it to the square. Clear the path and I'll follow you. Okay. A big revenant. Ooh. Lots of lightning. Okay, so what am I going to do? Is this going to start a chain? Chain costs... Yes, it will. Okay, so let's go ahead and do a chain. Oh, nice. It actually affects people around it. Adjacent enemies. Oh, so it does three to the center one. And then one to anyone around it. Which we should be able to take these guys out after that. There we go. What's, did I just... Oh, I, I gain XP as well. That's cool. Um, 
draw two cards and gain one. Okay, I get three out of six arcane charges. Uh, so I can. So I guess the wizard has these arcane charges. Uh, I'm gonna wait on that though. I'm just gonna do zap. Chain breaker deal. Plus. Plus two per. Arcane consumes. I don't want to do that. Let's just do lightning and take him out. Advancing in Old Town. Okay, there's more. So everything seems to reset. Alright, um, let's do... Lightning again, center. I should take care of all of them. Man, I like the wizard. Ooh, nasty. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and do this one. We'll take out these two. Around it. There we go. Now we've got these guys here. Um, lightning charge? Chain breaker. So it's going to break my chain. Draw a card and generate two arcane. Or whatever this is. Arcane charges, yeah. Next attack deals plus two damage. Hero gains two something for a turn. I don't know. Two skull. I don't know what that is. Uh, concentration. Chain breaker recovers. Two stamina and draws three cards. Undodgeable. Deal eight to a random enemy. I'll hold on to that one. Blink. Dodge. Range. Dodge and attack and make all enemies D. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do... Let's go ahead and use concentration to draw some cards. Alright, we've got lightning. There we go. Um, spend five to draw. Ooh. Lightning. Um, draw a card and generate two. I already got four. Alright, this doesn't cost anything except for... Yeah, I might as well use this on the two. Oh, no, I wanted to use that again. I, I guess that was a random enemy. Alright, fine. Blink. Melee. One turns left. Attacking enemies receive two damage for one turn. Next attack deals two melee. Well, they're almost dead, so... Alright, we'll zap. Deal two damage plus two per... Alright, let's do that. I think I'm out of stamina. I am. Okay, end turn. So they didn't do anything. Alright. Uh, we could zap this one. And we're out of stamina again. So end turn. Or I could... No, I don't have enough. End turn. Alright, minus one health. Lightning charge. I'll take it. Oh, I thought that... Oh, I thought that attacked for some reason. Alright, end turn. Huh. Not sure how he died, but okay, I'll take it. Alright, I'm almost leveled up to... I got 13 out of 15 XP. Oh, there's a nasty one. Volcanic Art. Deal 8 damage to a random enemy. I'd rather save that for this big guy here, if I can. Lightning Charge. Draw a card and generate 2 Arcane. Guess I gotta end turn now. Or I could do this Volcanic Art and be done with it. You know, let's just... We'll do it. Nice! It attacked the one I wanted. I got lucky there. Blink. I don't have enough. Alright, end turn. So, wow. I took a lot of damage. Zap. Deal two damage. Plus two per... Okay. Or dodge and attack. And make all enemies D. I guess we'll do that. Oh, distance. Okay. Alright. If we discard... Alright, end turn. So now they're moving up. Arcane Flow. Special ranged. Draw two cards and gain one stamina. Let's do that. We need to get rid of some of these guys if we can. Alright, all of my cards are defense. If I play this one, I might be able to kill somebody. But then I won't have any arcane left over to defend myself. Well, I think I'm going to die anyway.
If I can kill someone, maybe I'll level up and get all my health back. We'll find out. Do I le level up? Clarity of mind increases max stamina by one. Alright, I was hoping that I would regain health, but apparently that's not the case. If I discard this, what happens? Nothing. Okay. I was just curious. End turn. I'm dead. You died. You fell in Old Town. You overcame many dangers in Old Town. You have slain 15 foes on your way. Your equipment. Okay. Main menu. Alright, so I have to beat that scenario in order to unlock more stuff, I assume. Let's try um, the fighter and see if he's any different. Alright. Inner strength. Shield bash. Deal two damage. Stun for one turn and weaken for three turns. Oh, that's good. I guess we'll use that. Alright, he's stunned. We also want to stop this guy from doing anything. If we use concentration, recover two stamina, and we got 17 stamina. Holy cow. We'll use concentration. Chain breaker. Recover five stamina and draw five. That's okay. That's not. It. Yeah, we don't want to use that. All right, let's go ahead and end turn. Unless we, there's more cards we can play. No. All right, so he's gonna attack. I'm gonna go ahead and use weak block. All right, that block damage. Sword bash. I like that one. Deal four damage. Boom. Done. Um. Recover five. Let's go ahead and do that. Need more cards. End turn. Weak block. There we go. And I will spend five to draw another one. Tactical strike. Okay, I don't have any tactics. Deal ten damage. Oof. Alright, end turn. Or can we draw another card? Nope. We'd have to remove one of these. Recovery dodge? Huh. End turn. So if we use recovery dodge... Oh, he didn't attack anyway. Uh, end turn. Dodge. Okay, recover two energy or stamina. Gain one tactics. Okay, so that's one out of three now. Sword bash. I guess we'll do that one. Get rid of him. Alright, two, four, two. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of the one in the center here. I like the AoE that the wizard had, but he's very squishy. Defensive stance. Uh, gain two armor. Um, shield bash. Deal two damage. Might as well. Uh, let's draw a card. And... Chain breaker. Do we want... What's the maximum number of cards we can have in our hand? Five? Alright, let's just end turn. We could sword bash. Deal four damage and be done with it. It'd be nice if there's a, a, a weaker one. But. A ghoul. Sometimes leaps when distant to shorten. Oh, okay, so he's attacking very quickly here. Let's do recovery dodge. Um, Dull Sword Stab. Deal six damage. And stun. I think we'll use that on the big revenant. We don't want him attacking. Um, and then I will draw. And turn. Uh, again, we'll do recovery dodge. And defensive stance, uh, gain plus two armor, plus two extra stamina regeneration, and plus one extra regen draws a card. All right, let's do that. Again, nothing really to attack with. All right, end turn. Now this gives me two armor. He's got three. So that's, we'll play weak block anyway, because he's got a lot of attack power. He's going to get one attack through. There we go. 
Tactical idea. Gain three stamina and draw two cards. Sounds good. Sword bash. Let's take you out. And... I guess we'll... This is a chain breaker. Recover two stamina, three cards. I think at most I can only have five, though. So that's kind of a waste, I guess. Alright, end turn. We'll do recovery dodge. Sword bash. Kill them all. Alright, weak block. There we go. Um, shield bash. Deal two damage. No, no, okay, I want to kill them in one shot if I can. I will do sword bash against that one. Sword bash against that one. That leaves that. Um, I guess we'll end turn. And I have no defensive cards. Alright. Shield bash. Deal two damage. Stun. Let's do that. And we'll end turn again. Recover five stamina and draw a card. I like that. Concentration. I'd hate to use this dull sh uh, sword stab when he's only got two health left. We'll, we'll just end the turn and we'll use weak block. Recovery dodge. Okay. End turn again. Okay, we're gaining stamina. Okay, I guess we'll use the sword bash. I'm doing better as this character. Alright, so goals are attacking. I guess recovery dodge. Alright, this goal, weak block. Lost a little bit of health there. Alright, um, tactical idea. Gain three stamina, draw two cards, shield bash. Alright, let's, let's do that to the big revenant. Defensive stance. Tactical strike, which I don't have enough for that. Tactical idea. Gain three stamina and draw two cards. We want that. Sword bash, deal four damage. Let's get rid of one of these goals. And I guess the defensive stance would be a good idea. Because we're about we're gonna get attacked a lot this next turn here. So having some defense would be good. And we took still took some damage. This big revenant has three damage as opposed to two. Um Yes, we'll just end turn, recover more stamina. I've got weak block. Actually, I'm not going to do anything. Can I pass? I've got this defensive stance. Defensive stance, defensive stance. I will block with this one, though. Sword bash. Uh, deals four damage. Again, the ghoul. Take care of that. Endurance training increases stamina max by one. Alright, um, and turn. Again, none of these are going to do damage to me because I've got this defensive stance. So I'm not going to waste any cards. Oh, the big revenant had three, never mind. So I did take some damage. Alright, tactical strike. Undodgeable, deal ten damage. Four to all adjacent enemies. Wow. That's like a really powerful card. I'd hate to use it on this, but... If I use it on the Revenant on the right, that'll take out this one on the left as well. So I guess we'll do that. There we go. I could have done it in the middle, but the two Revenants would have been left. And then we'll go ahead and use Sword Bash. There we go. More stuff. Alright, recover five and then draw a card. Don't need to do that. Doll Sword Stab. Uh, deal six damage. Um, let's go do that against I suppose this revenant here 
recover five and draw a card. We can use that. Tactile strike. Unfortunately, can't really do anything. End turn. Uh, recovery dodge. Weak block. Recovery dodge. So we're going to take some damage here. Alright, time to bash some skulls in. That's one. Deal two damage. No, I don't want to do that. I could take out a crawler that way, I suppose. This one, Tactical Strike, if I play that here, that'll do four damage to all adjacent, so that'll take these out immediately. So we'll play that. And then, okay, we're out of stamina. End turn. Now right, we're going to take some damage. Concentration. Definitely need that. Uh, defensive stance. Shield bash. Let's do that against Tim. Instant kill. And we'll end turn. We have that weak block. No problem. Uh, fudge. End turn. Weak block again. Gain five back. All right, sword bash. Gotcha. Ooh, hulking horror. 40 health. Regeneration plus one. We're going to have to take out his friends first and then focus on the boss. Stun immune. All right, well, let's go with sword bash on this revenant. Knock him out. Uh, let's enter strength. This is for a chain breaker. Recover some stamina. Then reduce the cost of this one and take this guy out. And we have nothing left to use, so end turn. Alright, recovery dodge. Get a card that way. I could do weak block. But we'll still get one damage in. And that's two damage. Alright, not good. All right, six damage and stun. Uh, well, we're going to have to use that against... Do that. Gain three stamina, draw two cards. Uh, we will do that. Shield bash. All right, I will stun this one since I can't stun the one in the middle. And I could sword bash to do damage against him. But I won't stun him. I mean, I guess I could knock this guy out. But he's not... Yeah, I'm just going to do damage to the boss. Alright. 34. End turn. We've got recovery dodge here. Oh, he gets to do it again. I got another recovery dodge. Alright, we want concentration here. There we go. Defensive stance definitely would be very helpful. Uh, I'm going to play that. Inner Strength. Uh, recover 5 Stamina and draw a card. Yes. All of these are block cards, unfortunately. Uh, so I'm going to have to end my turn. Rage. Okay. Um, recovery Dodge. My turn. Shield Bash. I will do that against this one here. Kill him off, and that leaves me with the boss. Tactical strike. Undodgeable. Deal 10 damage. That's what I want to do. Take that. Alright. End turn. Recovery dodge. Recovery dodge. Sword bash. And that's it for me, I guess. Weak block. Luckily, I had that defensive stance up. All right, uh, deal six damage and stun. All right, let's do that. He's down to 18. I need more attack cards. Smash, great. Weak block. I'm taking hits. Oh no, I think I'm dead. This blocks for three. 
Oh, I've got one health left. Oh, defensive stance. Is that all I've got, really? Tactical idea. Gains three and draws two cards, I guess. Concentration. Recover two. Yes, we need that. All right. Uh... I need to save stamina for defense because on the next a attack, he's going to do four damage. Of all I got three by default. So I'm. this is six. I'm going to pass. We'll have to use weak block. There we go. Shield bash. That's not going to do anything. Weaken for three turns. So I could still use shield bash and weaken him. But... He's got five attack on this, so I need to find a way to draw. All right, let's draw a card and hope it's the defense card. All right, weak block. And then we'll shield bash for three turns. Or, all right, let's now nah, we'll just try and take him out. And end turn. I forgot to save stamina. Oh, no. I forgot about my stamina. You died. You fell in Old Town. You overcame many dangers in Old Town. You've slain 27 foes along the way. Oh, that was disappointing. I forgot about the stamina. Okay, well, it was close. We'll have to try again in the next video. If you guys haven't already, subscribed to my YouTube channel and check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.